Hi, 40 Pilots. Welcome back, and I hope you're all safe. The first big mistake that uh, new home brewers make is uh, trying to cut corners to save time. Each step in the brewing process needs to be done in the correct way and also with the correct equipment to give you, obviously, the best results. Don't worry, it won't be too long before you work out your own routine. Another common mistake is not checking the best before dates on the beer kits or fermentables, etc. Using anything out of date, including the yeast, will obviously impact the uh, results of your beer kit. This could lead to no fermentation starting at all, um, and if fermentation does start with the out of date beer kits, it will definitely lead to a horrible tasting brew. Another common mistake that new home brewers make is cleaning and sanitising. Cleaning and sanitising, as I said in other videos, aren't the same thing. Cleaning is removing all the dirt and sanitising is removing the majority of the microbes. This step is super, super important and you should never cut corners on the cleaning and sanitising. Most new home brewers also believe you can make beer as a set and forget method, which this obviously isn't correct. Brewing outside of the yeast's fermentation temperatures will produce hot or fusel alcohols and make your beer at the end very less enjoyable. Controlling the temperature of your homebrew is extremely important, so get making a fermentation chamber or find a room with a constant temperature within your yeast's fermentation temperatures. Another common mistake that new home brewers are making is worrying. Remember, worrying is the exact opposite of what home brewing is all about. If you make a mistake, don't worry, because nine times out of 10, your batch will turn out fine. Once you've done a quite a few batches, you'll start to have a routine and a method. Just relax, don't panic, and take each step as it comes. A big newbie mistake is patience. Beer making is a simple process, but it does take time to create our favourite brews. Never open your fermenter too early, always rely on your hydrometer, be meticulous in your cleaning and sanitising, buy the best beer kits and also ingredients that you can, keep your beer at the correct temperatures, allow to condition in the bottles for at least two weeks, be patient and it won't be long to you enjoying all your hard work. <laughs> Another common mistake that new homebrewers make is drinking your beer far too early. So you've fermented your beer, you've primed your beer, you've bottled it, you've only left it about a week and decided to crack open one. For sure you can do this, but you're going to ruin all that hard work that you've done. Some brews do even need three months conditioning. It's for this reasons that we always have one brewing, we always have one priming, and we have at least three or four conditioning, so we've always got our beer at its best flavour. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification for future videos. Stay safe.